the pruning methods for peaches and nectarines are very much the same. Peaches and nectarines are pruned to either an informal vase or to a two-liter trellis, also known as a fruiting wall, while the single-liter system is being phased out. The first step is to remove damaged limbs. There are often limbs broken by the wind or a heavy crop load, and these are the first to be removed. Peaches and nectarines only crop on one-year-old wood, so you want as much one-year-old wood as possible. And, as with all fruit types, allowing light to reach the leaves through all parts of the tree is important. There are two shapes that peaches and nectarines are pruned to. The first is the four-leader Spanish vase, which has four strong leaders. The second is a fruiting wall that is supported on a flat, upright trellis with two central leaders spaced about a meter apart. Peaches and nectarines bear fruit on one-year-old wood. The fruit develops from single flowers carried in reproductive lateral buds on one-year-old wood. Having identified the structural branches, the aim is to retain as much one-year-old wood as possible, as close as possible, to the structural limb. Once the shoot has borne its crop, it will not bear again and it is removed. So a lot of removal pruning is done on a peach tree with the objective of having four central leaders with only one-year-old wood on those leaders. Ideally, the one-year-old should be 30 centimeters long and not longer than 60 centimeters long as a shoot longer than 60 centimeters will tend to grow too vigorously. Pruning peaches and nectarines tends to be quite easy. A branch is either a structural branch or a one-year-old shoot, and the rest goes. One-year-old wood, as close to the structural limb as possible. Remove matchsticks. Very thin one-year-old wood, known as matchsticks, can also be removed, as they use up scarce reserves that can be allocated to the stronger buds in the tree if they are removed. Put nice bearing wood on this. It's very important to get the light into the tree as soon as possible to mature the one-year-old wood. Back to the mother. If it doesn't mature properly, it tends to die back. Never head peach or nectarine one-year-old wood as it will die back. The structural limb is regarded as the mother in peaches, that's the mother, and the one-year-old wood is regarded as the children. The one-year-old wood's got all the blossom, and that's where the peaches will be born. So one tries to keep the children as close to the mother as possible. So yeah, we got children, 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 and they're as close to the mother as possible. So we try bring them back to the mother. So to summarize, identify the structural limbs and try and keep the one year wood that is 60 centimeters and shorter. Well, that's it for peaches and nectarines. Please note that our pruning programs give the general theory related to the pruning activity. Adapt the information to your own situation and chat to a consultant who can advise you in your orchard if you have further queries.